one of the most patient people in the stadium is probably also one of the most excited people in the stadium. Boise State Director of Athletics, Jeremiah Dickey joins us now. And I started the show by saying, Jeremiah, I wait nine months for this day. This is one of my favorite days of the year. Football finally back in the city of trees. What's it like to host everybody for a house party on the blue? This is what it's all about. All the hard work, the, the I mean, this started last season before last season was done. And we're already starting to think about next season. That's just part of the process. And so it's nice to have our closest friends and family here. Bronco Nation, uh, uh, they did their job, and, and I'm excited for tonight. I'm not trying to get distracted, but, man, you got a way cooler backdrop. Yeah. We finally get to see the scoreboard yeah. in, its, in, its, uh, in its glory. How excited are you to uh, kick this thing off and see Bronco Nation's reaction to that thing? Yeah, I mean, that and the lights and, and I mean, this is what it's about, right? We're going to improve on the experience every year. Our expectation is for Bronco Nation to see something different every game. That board has, has, has taken a lot out of us, you know, but we're almost there and people are getting to see it now. And, and once the back is done, which is going to be epic, um, that's what we're, we're striving for. And so I'm excited. Let's hit on that really quick. Uh, the back. You got to control what you can control, right. which That's is super right. frustrating. I get that. But it might be a little while, I guess, before we actually see the finished product on the back. As much as you can say, what happened there, Jeremiah? Long story short, we ordered the cladding on the back. There was a specific color that we're looking for. Blue is an important color for us, and it did not come in uh, the color that we needed. And they had to specifically make that cladding for this board. So it was a waste. And so now we are going back, we've gone back to the manufacturer to say this is not the blue that we had asked for, and, and they're working on it. So it happens. We're, we're going to control what we can. We're excited. They've done a great job. They've been great partners for us and, and with us. And, you know, what's next? we we got to keep moving forward. So the board is one of the things that fans are going to see the second they walk into the stadium. It's obvious. But there's something new that they're going to have to wait a second for. That's those LED lights. How excited? You already got the blue field, the blue jerseys. Now the blue light's coming into the picture. Yeah, I mean, I'm excited, but, you know, since I've been here, everyone talked about we don't like late games. We don't like late games. <laughs> we have all these early games now, and now everyone's like, we need a later game. No, like, hopefully we see it in the fourth quarter, and, and we've been out here. You guys were out here last night. It's, it's amazing, and it makes a difference. And so when you see that third and fourth quarter break, it's going to be something that hopefully the fans embrace, and, and we're, we're excited to start these new traditions. Jeremiah, we could talk to you forever on this show. I blame NASCAR for eating into our interview time with you. Go enjoy game day. As always, we appreciate you joining us on Bronco Roundup Game Day. Thank you, guys. Go Broncos. <laughs>